Hi, this is going to be my first video in English and I got a few questions I will cover but before I do that I want to tell like because this is about like my life here and I'm not going to live here any longer because my house family decided to go in rematch but I will do I will do a video about rematch and explain um, what that is and how how does this work and but in German not in English <laughs> okay so but the question is how how does my day look like so my routine my actually routine is I work from 7:30 to 5 30 and three days a week um, the two years old go, goes to daycare and the eight months old girl is here the whole week so for example Monday I have both both kids and I know he watches uh, his TV show in the morning and then he has breakfast and I sometimes go for a walk um, in the morning because I can't, I need to be at home at 10 because the little one goes to bed, like the, t the eight months old. Um, and then he goes to bed at 12 and she goes to bed again at 3. So I can't really do something in the afternoon. So that's the most thing I do going for a walk or go to a grocery store or something like that. When I, and it's kind of the same when I just have the eight months old, she has the same nap time, so I mostly play with them at home. Mm. The food here is good. I mean, the most people think that, I don't know, they connect America with fast food and all that stuff, but it's not like that. Um, I mean, in Colorado, it's, I don't, I don't know about other states, but in Colorado, it's like, Colorado is the healthiest state in the USA. So, I don't know, but you don't need to eat fast food. You just go to the grocery store and buy vegetables and fruits and healthy stuff so you can you can live healthy if you if you're here so that's not really a big problem um, I don't really cook that often by myself um, just sometimes but when I cook it's not really like a hard recipe I just put some vegetables in the pan and grill them and I think that's it or I cook some rice, noodles, whatever, but not really. Or I eat salad and yeah, it's that's not really cooking. So what did I do when my mom was here? My mom, when she was here, I showed her everything I want to show her. We went to Boulder, that's the next city after Denver like the next big city. Um, we went to Red Rocks, that's the amphitheater in the mountains, with, where you can see uh, Denver from the top. We went to the Cherry Creek Mall, that's a shopping mall, and we went for Christmas gifts there. Mm. My mom cooked Austrian dish here. She did um, Schwanzbraten with knödel. Yeah, and she did tomatoes with Kubiskan oil. That was so delicious and I really missed her food. <laughs> um, then my house parents bought us tickets for a Christmas carol. Um, that
that was a musical. So we went there. We... Yeah, we went to downtown. And two days I worked when she was here, while she was here. So we did stuff with the kids, like went for a walk or we went to the aquarium. And I think that's it, I guess. I don't know. I think so. Yeah, and one day we went, uh, we went out for dinner. Um, and the next question is if the kids listen to me. I mean, an eight months old don't really listen because she's just too young. But the two years old, he listens very good to me. Um, when I say something, for example, can you please put that back because it's dangerous or he just is not allowed to play with that. He just put it, puts it away or... When I say, can we go downstairs? Can we go upstairs? He immediately goes to the stairs and goes upstairs. When I say, when I say, can you sit in your high chair? He's going to his high chair and like waits for me to pull him up and put him in his high chair. He's a really good listener. I mean, of course, sometimes he he's a little bit naughty. Um, and but. For the most of the time, he's a really good listener, and he mostly does this what I, what I say. Um, what's different here than in Vienna, for example, the people? So what's really different here is that if you like, if you go for a walk and people like pass you. They like say hi, how are you, how's it going, and like they greet you, and I don't know, you you don't do this in Vienna. I mean, I don't, I haven't seen that that someone like. I mean, where I live, where my house is, you say hi or good morning, but when you walk in the like, I don't know, I don't think it's really like they do it a lot here so it's I think it's different than in Vienna or when you go in the shop like I don't know for clothes or something they're almost annoying because I don't know if you go in there and you just want to take a look or you know you don't really want to buy something you just go there and look um, you the people the shop assistants come to you and say hi how's it going my name is blah 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 and if you need something i can help you and blah 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 and they talk and then you say i'm good i'm just browsing i'm just looking and then a few minutes they come back and say everything okay blah 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 and that's kind of annoying because i just want to go in there and like take a look for like just you know window shopping or i don't know how it's called and i don't really want to buy something so that's really annoying and i mean the shop assistants in Vienna do that too, but they just ask if they can help you and that's it. They don't come to you like a thousand of times and ask you if they if they can help you. So that's a little that's a little bit annoying and yeah. Um the driving is different here. For example, if you are on a red light and you want to take a turn right you can and there's no sign who says it's not allowed you can turn right when the red is light uh, when the light is red um, and I I think that some Americans can't drive they're just so annoying and I mean you have that everywhere but it's like really because in Vienna I, I didn't really drive that much and here I drive like almost every day and it's like I'm freaking out um, yeah but I love Denver and yeah it's probably uh, it's sad that I probably need to move away from here 
but my impression from Denver is like I really love it here it's a great area I just need five minutes to downtown and it's really great here so yeah that was the video it's like 10 minutes long now so I will stop talking and I hope you liked it and I hope I didn't do that much mistakes my English is not perfect but I try my best and I'll see you soon bye